You're watching Good Morning Carolinas with Jason Glassbowl, Crystal Costa, meteorologist Darren Stack, and Amanda Kinson. Welcome back, everyone. Well, on this Monday morning, we've got a fun little live shot to get to. Yes, we do. A pottery studio in Myrtle Beach had quite a successful tea party over the weekend, but fear not if you missed it, you or your kids, there's another one coming up soon. Yeah, this morning, WPD News Channel 15's Amanda Kenseth is live at Harry the Potter in Myrtle Beach with all the <laughs> details. How's it going, Amanda? I love this. This is the cutest idea ever. Well, first of all, I love being here because it's a lot of fun. I've been here before, I made my very own coffee mug, and now, we're making little tea sets. Talk awesome. a little bit about this. And we've got all these girls with us. We do, and thank you for getting up early this morning, <laughs> ladies. I guess I should say it like that, ladies. So um, every month we have a tea party and you bring your babies with you and we paint this lovely tea set and then you get to take it home and have your very own tea party with your baby as much as you like and you get this lovely little tea set with it. So we teach the girls how to paint this tea set and put on lovely little polka dots and they get to do... Um, paint their own set and then we have a tea party and eat cupcakes and drink tea and we use a pretty little china set and they have a good time and everybody has to talk like this and put on your lovely hats and your jewels. Uh oh, I'm going to have to work on my accent. I don't know if I can do that. Um, but they already look like, they must be professionals. They look like they know what they're doing they already. Are, they are. They're very good painters. They're very good. I think they have a, a plan for each plate there. Yeah. Well, how did all this come about? What made you decide to do this? So, um, the American Girl thing has been very big uh, in our house. Um, lover of baby dolls and baby clothes and tea sets and tea parties. So okay. um, we figured that'd be a fun thing to do with other little girls around the area. And um, just decided to put together a tea party. We've had a great response. Everybody loves it. We've had a couple people come back a few times. Yeah. And um, it's a very exclusive thing. We shut down the whole studio so it's just 12 girls. We set Such it up and they get to do ha, have a very exclusive little tea party with their baby. Such a great idea and I love American Girl too. I had one when I was growing up. So I think this is perfect, ladies. And she even called us ladies. You like I think she's getting excited. <laughs> She'll have a British accent by the end of the show. That's the most adorable thing. And the title, Harry the Potter. Yes. I mean, too cute. If you're looking for something creative for your kids to do this fall, a local pottery studio has great ways for them to make some art and have some fun at the same time. Yeah. WPDE yeah. News Channel 15's Amanda Kinseth is having some fun there at Harry the Potter in Myrtle Beach having a tea party, huh Amanda? <laughs> Crystal, I am having so much fun, you have no idea. You need to come and do this. Uh, so first of all, I would like you to look at the beautiful ladies next to me who got up early. They are so super creative. They're all eight, wait, excuse me, eight and a half years <laughs> old. And uh, this is the American Girl Party. You guys have a tea party once a month and it's coming up at the end of the October. We do, we do. Uh, the, the next one is October 27th. And at every tea party, I love how your accent kicks in. That's right. Yes. <laughs> every time we paint tea sets, I have to talk like this or drink from teacups with talk like that. So one of the very most important things you do when you paint your tea set is the polka dots. It's really important because this, every time you make a polka dot, you say how much you love your baby. So you go like this and you say, I love my baby. I love my baby. And every time you do it, you say you love your baby, so you have lots of love in your tea set. Now, if you love your baby a lot, like I do, you put lots and lots and lots of polka dots all over everything. If you don't like it very much, you just put one. <laughs> just one little dot, and that's it, and then you're done. And then she might be a little sad, but that's all right. That's great. All right, I've got, I love my baby, so you love your I'm baby, So you put lots of polka dots. Mine lots. has lots of love. <coughs> She's okay. got many different colors of love. Yeah, well, polka dots are good. fun. Polka dots are, are good. And they're easy to do. You just take the back of the paintbrush. It's a little trick. You stick it in like this, and when you put it down like that, you get the perfect dot every single time. You don't have to mess around with the top of the brush. It gets a little messy this this way. It's easy. I think I made my polka dots overly big because I was worried my baby would think I didn't love them. No, you, you <laughs> obviously love your baby. <laughs> That's All what right. I love. Well, Crystal, we love our babies over here and we're having a little tea party. <laughs> That's right. Very nice with the accent. You're getting better and lovely. <laughs> 
<laughs> Thank you, Amanda Kinseth out in Myrtle Beach at Harry the Potter. And we should mention they just had a huge tea party event, but they have one coming up in a couple of weeks. And they do these sort of tea parties uh, individually if you're interested. And they do birthday parties, so look them up online.